Forget blogging and MySpace. If you really want to stay connected, there is a new service, and supposedly it is the next big thing. It's a name you can't forget. There's four friends who built this thing, and they wanted to build a technology that would connect them to their friends. In the instant messaging system called Twitter. Twitter, you can actually follow me by going to twitter.com slash Cameron Hall. From almost from the moment that Twitter was was hatched, um, it became this thing that started to change the world. Spontaneous. Busy. Busy. Hashtag. I, mean <laughs> I would say dramatic. In 2006, Twitter was founded by Jack Dorsey, Noah Glass, Liz Stone, and Evan Williams in San Francisco, California. Twitter was created as a way for people to communicate ideas, sort of like a massive group text on the internet. In March 2006, the first prototype of Twitter was made available to the members of the podcast company Odeo, where the founders worked until a few months later when it became open to the public. Originally, the Twitter name was five letters long, missing the vowels in the middle of the name. Shortly thereafter, the developers changed it to the current name, Twitter, which has always been represented by the popular blue Twitter bird. On March 21st, 2006, founder Jack Dorsey sent the first tweet, Just setting up my Twitter. Twitter's popularity growth exploded in 2007, less than a year after the site was launched. On average, users were tweeting 5,000 times a day in 2007. By 2008, that number was 300,000. In 2009, it had grown to 2.5 million per day, and in 2013, users sent over 400 million tweets per day. Uh, how often do you use it? Uh, never. <laughs> never? Like once a month, I'll go and check something. Once a month? Okay, so do you have a Twitter? I tweet every once in a while. Yeah. Tweet every once in a while? One of the most substantial impacts on the popularity of Twitter was the introduction of mobile smartphone capability. It allowed for users to tweet and access other people's tweets from anywhere by using their smartphone. Twitter allows its users to stay connected with friends and family and meet new people. It is equipped with many features that allow easy ways to stay connected. As a Twitter user, you can post tweets that show on your followers' homepages. Tweets allow users to express their thoughts and opinions to their friends, family members, and other followers. Tweeting also allows users to post pictures and videos that they want to share. Tweeting is the most important aspect of Twitter because tweets make up everything on Twitter users' homepages. Followers are the people who are subscribed to your Twitter account and can see your tweets on their homepage. You can also follow other users so that you can see their tweets on your homepage. Your followers can favorite or retweet your tweets, and you can favorite and retweet theirs as well. Favorites and retweets are ways to connect with other Twitter users and gain followers. When you favorite someone's tweet, it notifies them and appears on their tweet. A retweet is more substantial. It copies their tweet and allows it to show on your homepage, as well as the homepages of all of your followers. Another important feature of Twitter is direct messaging, which allows users to send messages to each other without requiring personal information such as cell phone numbers or email addresses. It allows for a safe way to get in touch with other Twitter users, while still only being seen by the two users involved in the direct message. Another major innovation made by Twitter is the creation of the hashtag. A hashtag is a pound sign followed by a word or phrase that adds character to the tweet and allows people to see what everyone is tweeting about. Twitter provides a world in which information can be passed around to millions of users within seconds. As a whole, Twitter has revolutionized social media and communication by allowing quick and easy transfer of thoughts and information. What's your name? Ashley. Ashley, I'm Kobe. Nice, nice to meet you. you. We're going to be interviewing for a documentary. Um, my first question is, how would you say Twitter affects your social life? Um, I feel like Twitter would affect my social life by drama. Okay. Being connected to multiple friends, meeting new people. Okay. Um, just, you can learn different stuff on Twitter. Yeah. Funny pictures, songs, 
Okay. We got you. All right. So, uh, how does Twitter affect your social life? Twitter, uh, you know, it's just the way I see it. It's just another one of those network marketing. I mean, not network marketing. I'm sorry. It's just another one. Uh, what is it? Uh, social networking. Yeah. Just you know, another one of those sites where people can actually get in contact with okay. each other and whatnot. Awesome. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, I guess that's what what developed the hashtags, right? That's, that's when right. hashtags started coming out. So, yeah. I mean, that's how that really started getting popular. That, I mean, when I first got into it. I liked it because of the hashtag, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. Made things more simple, like bullets did. You know it like connected you to, exactly. it connected me, okay. Uh -huh. How does Twitter affect your social life? Well, I guess sometimes if you post like, you know, really personal things, it of course can affect you. I, I actually one time said something personal and it really did affect me because it caused me a problem with my boyfriend, so. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so how does Twitter affect your social life? It doesn't really. I use more like other social medias. Like what? Like Facebook? Facebook, Reddit, things like that. Okay. Not only is Twitter a large social networking site, but it is also a very financially successful business. The Twitter franchise is worth a large sum of $17 billion. There are three main ways for a company or an individual to advertise on Twitter. By promoting a tweet that will appear in people's timelines, promoting a whole account, or promoting a trend. About 85% of Twitter's revenue is from advertising on Twitter's site. A business can pay to have Twitter promote them on every Twitter user's live feed. A budget is usually set at the start of the campaign and then the advertiser pays per click or per retweet. Twitter makes most of the rest of its profit through data licensing. This is when companies buy data from Twitter. This data contains information such as favorites, retweets, and trends on their products. This helps companies to develop an understanding of their customer demographic. Some very popular businesses that use Twitter include Home Depot, Kodak, Starbucks, and Dell. Businesses are able to effectively use Twitter to promote their products and spread ideas about their company. What are your thoughts about it, just in general? Um, I personally love Twitter. Really? Yeah. I, it's fun. I mean, you yeah, talk to everybody. Connect. It helps you connect with people, would you say, right? Let people know what stuff is. Like yeah. Games or I understand. Like party or... Oh, yeah. No, no, it's cool. I understand. <laughs> okay, yeah. It's a lead up. Yeah. Um, what are your thoughts about Twitter? I mean, I guess it's just, you know, a way to like let people know what you're doing. And, I mean, sometimes it's a good way to communicate with people, but at the same time, it's really not, not necessary. Okay, okay. Um, what are your thoughts about Twitter? I like it. I think it's clever. I think it's good for, like, you can, it's more, you can be closer to people and it allows celebrities to become closer to their fans a okay. lot of time. Okay, thank you. Nice. Y'all know about this. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, what do, how does it, like, what does Twitter mean to you? Twitter mean to me? Yeah, like, mm, I don't know, like, it's just a, it's just an opening. You know yeah. What I'm saying? Opening. Just Connect like you. A lot of things. Yeah. yeah. You know, it brings you. Uh, would you say it brings you closer to any of your friends? You know. You know, I've actually met a couple friends on Twitter. And okay. So. Okay. The way I see it, it's yeah, like I was saying, it's a, it's just a, another opening to uh, another part of what people like or whatnot. Yeah. Or, I understand. You know, what I'm saying it, it kind of helps grow us into uh, another part of culture. Or, yeah. Or whatnot, okay. because. Because of hashtags, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. When, when, it, when they started doing hashtags, it wasn't everybody who was like, oh, hashtag this, hashtag yeah. that, you know what I'm saying? I feel you. It's like a trend, I guess. Yes, exactly. Started okay. Whole, yeah. You don't hear that a lot. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, thanks, Katie. Well, you can tell everybody. Yeah, you can tell everybody. Is that it? <laughs>